He was really all wrought up and you could just sense how much anger he had. And so he was really trying to dominate and then literally stalk me around the stage. And I would just feel this presence behind me. <laughs> Hillary confirms to Ellen what millions witnessed last Sunday, this meme-worthy moment. I thought, whoa, this is really weird. Everything you've heard just now from Donald is not true. Consistently just spewing forth falsehoods. And when you catch him, when you say, no, wait a minute, you, you said this, you actually we're on the record on this. No, I wasn't. No. Yes, Hillary puts Trump in his place. It is sort of amusing to hear somebody who hasn't paid federal income taxes in maybe 20 years talking about what he's going to do. And now a YouTuber has put together this amazing parody video of Arrested Development, renaming it Trump Rested Development. Someone who has said pregnancy is an inconvenience to employers, who has said, said women... Pregnancy is never... Um, it's a wonderful thing for the woman. It's a wonderful thing for the husband. It's certainly an inconvenience for a business. Throughout the campaign, the Obamas have continued to push Team Hillary, with Michelle speaking out yesterday about Trump's latest scandal. This wasn't just locker room banter. This was a powerful individual speaking freely and openly about sexually predatory behavior. The men that you and I know don't treat women this way. They are loving fathers who are sickened by the thought of their daughters being exposed to this kind of vicious language about women. Yesterday, four new women came forward claiming they were either groped or touched inappropriately by the presidential candidate. And two of their stories were published by the New York Times. Trump denies this ever happened and is threatening to sue for libel. But the publication has a message for Trump. Bring it on. Nothing in our article has had the slightest effect on the reputation that Mr. Trump, through his own words and actions, has already created for himself.